All right, everybody, so we are on level six. Again, I'm Miss Nunez. I am a computer science teacher working with middle school students, and we are using the CS Discoveries curriculum. So right now we're in unit two on web development, and we are on our way to making a multi-page website. So this is very exciting. Uh, today we are learning about linking pages, and so here's the deal with assessments. I know it's an assessment because of that blue, or that uh, purple check mark, and I will read the directions. I will give you some hints. I will not do it for you um, because what kind of assessment would it be if I did? So let's take a look and we'll also look at the rubric. All right, so instructions, adding new pages. To make your multi-page website, you'll need to add multiple pages to your project. To practice, let's split the content on the sample page into two pages and link them together. Do this, add a new HTML file by clicking add HTML, that's right here. The new file will appear in the files list on the left side of the workspace. Rename the file either by right clicking it and choosing rename or by clicking on it when it's already highlighted. Make sure the name is unique, descriptive and ends in HTML. Use HTML to fill out your new page. You can use content from the main page. Link to your new page from index.html link back to the index from your new page. So that's what you're doing, that's your assessment. All right, um, let's look at the rubric and make sure you can get all the points. All right, so we're gonna start uh, down here at the bottom with no evidence. So this is a bad grade, this is an F. No new page was created and there are no links. So don't do that, we want, I mean, we wanna see you add links and make a new page. So let's move, let's close that. All right, now let's look at where we're going to start getting some points. Limited evidence. There is a link tag, but syntax errors or problems with the page name may prevent it from working. So if you have something that is a link tag, I almost showed you what it was. I can't do that. Um, then if you have one, but it doesn't work, all right, you're looking at limited evidence. Convincing evidence. There is at least one working link from one HTML page to another. So there you go. You have at least one working. That gives you convincing evidence. But then here's the one we really want to focus on. This is where I want to see all of you guys. Extensive evidence. A new page has been created, given a unique and descriptive name ending in HTML. There is a link from the index HTML page to the new page and from the new page back to index.html. All right, so that's what gets you the 100A, and that's what I want you to shoot for, okay? So there we go. I've given you all the hints and tips and tricks. Uh, don't forget you have your help and tips right here. You have your instructions that I've already read for you, um, and we have your rubric. You can do this. I have absolute faith in you. Uh, when you're finished and you've done all the work, you're going to click the orange finish button, and off we go. All right, good luck.